Hello, I'm Dr. Heidi Monahan, and I'm a podiatrist with Pitham Podiatry Associates. And I'm Dr. James Shepick, the medical director of MidMichigan's Wound Treatment Center in Midland. Today, we're going to discuss how non-healing wounds can result from poor circulation caused by peripheral artery disease, also known as PAD. When a sore or a wound doesn't have enough blood supply, it affects your body's ability to heal the wound. It can also increase the risk of infection. That's why people with poor circulation due to PAD often need specialized wound care. PAD is a narrowing of the arteries to your arms and legs, limiting blood flow. Less blood flow means that less oxygen and fewer nutrients reach the wound site, which can hinder healing. If a wound is infected, PAD can also prevent antibiotics from getting to the wound. Eventually, tissue can die, which in the most serious cases can lead to amputation. People with diabetes who are at greater risk of developing PAD have to be particularly careful to avoid foot injuries, which can lead to diabetic foot ulcers. In fact, vascular disease and diabetes are the leading causes of amputations in the United States. The good news is that most patients with vascular disease can prevent serious complications by getting proper treatment for sores in the early stages before they become serious. Exercising, medications, proper diet, avoiding tobacco, and managing any underlying conditions such as diabetes or high blood pressure can prevent PAD from developing or progressing. For patients with PAD or other conditions that hinder wound healing, MidMichigan Health's PAD program and wound treatment center offer the most advanced treatments to prevent limb loss. Our comprehensive team at the Wound Treatment Center specializes in difficult to heal wounds that are often associated with PAD. Your care team will include specialists from a variety of areas to address the causes and treatment for your wound. For information about our wound treatment centers, visit www.midmichigan.org wound.